Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. We are playing with some new Shantikai today. Oh my goodness, look at these beauties. I know. We are going to play around with some of these and then also I have some, I kind of popped out this KJH and tried that on. So, and of course, a few items from Jones Road. Wanted to just get ready, have some fun, chit chat, and to see how I got this look. Keep watching. All right, let's put on, I have this Prada Beauty. This is their foundation. It's refillable, which is cool. Mine is in MN40. That's what it looks like out of the packaging here. MN40, and I'm just gonna put this on. I use a little bit. I really like this. It gives a pretty glow, and it's not too heavy on the skin, but it just kind of evens you out which I prefer. It's nice, right? Like, just easy, not bad. If there's any kind of spots or whatnot, I've been using the Jones Road Stick for concealer. Also, I took it to Italy with me. I use the 16 shade all over for foundation. It's the only thing I took for foundation. But I like using 12 kind of right under the eyes a little bit just to brighten. You can use a lighter shade if you want a brighter effect or whatnot, but it's so good and it's so easy. And I just use my finger, kind of like warm it up and pat it in. It's really, really nice. And I'll just kind of go over any types of places. I also like to go around my lips, I know. But I feel like my lipstick it's just more defined if I do that, if I'm using a lip liner, just a little trick or whatnot. Something I do, really like, I really like it. So the next thing we're gonna use is something new and uh, this is, you know, what the video is about. This is the new Shantikai Holiday Collection. I bought two pieces and these are the two pieces. It's really pricey, y'all. It's beautiful though. Here is the packaging. Like, isn't that just stunning? And it's 5.5 grams of product. It's the Radiant Glow Blur Powder. What kind of drew me to this was this kind of shade. It's almost like a pinky lavender color. And it's so nice. It's really, really pretty. I just want to use a little bit under the eyes. I think this would kind of, it's radiant, but so this is a swatch of it. And that's a heavy swatch, guys. I mean, it's not going to look. This is what it is blended in. You can barely see it on. See it? See the glow kind of right there? Yeah. So it's it's going to be subtle, but I like subtle. It's just me. I was thinking I would use something like this. My Kitco Pro. It's my domed multi. It looks like this. And I'll just go in and apply under the eye right here. Yeah, this is good. Pretty, right? And then if you want to, you could just kind of go up and it does have a blurring effect to it. Definitely if you can see that, I hope you can see that, but it definitely has this blur kind of effect to it. I'm going to use a different brush now. This is the Sony G Indoshi Pro brush. It's kind of almost like a candlestick type. Look how pretty that is. Oh, and blurring. You see the blur? Really nice. This is kind of like your no powder powder, and I'm just, that's my favorite type of powder because I don't want to look like I am wearing makeup. I mean, yes, am I going to look like I'm wearing makeup? Yeah, but I mean, I want it to look natural and pretty and just easy, right? Effortless, classic. It's really what I'm going for. Next up, I have to put my primer on, the NARS primer, so much prefer. I cannot find anything better than this, y'all. I really can't. I just, it's 
smear it on my eyes <laughs> and then rub it in. But I have to say, I took this Rare Beauty. This is the um, eye gel with the little brush or whatnot. And it's like a gel for your eyebrows, but it just keeps them up, but it's not going to flake. This is so nice. Like I said, I took it with me on my trip. If you don't know, if you're not following my Instagram, you have to follow me on Instagram at Just Glow Firefly, but I posted a few little travel um, reels of, we went to Italy for a, a week, well, 10 days or so, and it was so fun and so exciting and just just a fun time. It was good to get away, but it's also good to come home, kind of a homebody at heart, sleep in your own bed, all the things. But it was it was fun. It was cool to explore and try different things and new things or whatnot. Sometimes I, I get a little heavy, so I just wanna, with a clean spoolie. I just save spoolies. I wash them and save them from mascara wands or whatnot before. It's so, easy to just reuse them and I really like doing that. That was the powder, the blur powder. And I'll put all the description of the product below in the description box with as well as links. And uh, those are usually affiliate links, if just assume they are. <laughs> but I really appreciate you guys supporting me and using those if that's something that you you want to do or you know are doing. So thank you so much. This one here is the Radiant Gold Eye Shimmer. This is, it says gold leaf, so let's see. It's 2.5 grams of product. Look at this though. I mean, look at that. Isn't that so pretty? It's two different colors in here, almost like a pink and a gold. See how this looks on. Ooh, it's got a lot of shimmer, a lot of shimmer, okay. It's Emma, it kind of is a little duo chromey. It's a pretty one and done shade for sure. Ooh. One little speck of fallout. That was it. What do you think? That is really, really pretty. The formula is pretty. Y'all have got to tell me if you tried this below. I know it's been out for a minute, but I haven't been able to film it because I haven't been here. <laughs> Very pretty. There's gold, there's pink. You can build it. It's got this like pinky gold reflect to it. I might add a liner. Yeah, it's really nice. Here's the Shantikai Raven eyeliner. Let's try that just right at the base of the lashes. I could smudge that if I want, but I don't really want to. That looks good. Let's hope, hope for the best for the other eye. I can usually do one eye and then the other eye is just kind of like a hot mess, but we'll see. Okay, mascara's on. Let's add Jones Road. This is the blush, the best blush in Sandy, which is such a nice shade, y'all. It is so pretty and easy and just a great, I mean, the blushes are underrated. Like, look how pretty that is. Ah, so this is Sandy. It's kind of like a cool tone pink. Oh, brush. <laughs> the brush I'm using is the Face Pro by Sonya G. Gosh, her brushes are phenomenal, y'all. They are just so good. Then we're going in with Jones Road Bronzer and Medium Tan. And I might do a separate video on the KJH brand, but I want to try it. So, sneak peek. <laughs> this is the Light Pink. Hyper Brilliance, Hyper Shine, Light Pigment. And so what my understanding is, is you use the Hyper Shine Serum and you put it in here like so. And then it comes with a brush if you buy the kit or whatnot. So just 
rubbing it around in here. I've just seen her tutorials or whatnot. And then, ooh, look at that. Wow. Um, that glow. Whoa. It's so good. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. I need a mirror. <laughs> I think this serum is what really makes this kind of glow even more. I didn't put a whole lot of serum. Whoops. It definitely like activates it, I feel like. That is so pretty. I mean, it's a lot. I mean, it is a glow. Wow, that's cool. Now I got the pink one, I got the pink one. So I'm curious about the other shades, but the pink one's pretty. Let's go over the lips with the shade Rosewood by Jones Road, I Can't Stop with these pencils, y'all. Like, look at that. Mmm, so good. That is so pretty. Rosewood, so let me grab my Chantecaille lip gloss. I have to see if it's the same one. Let me look it up. It's the same one. This is Blythe lip gloss and it's like a really pretty light pink color with gold reflect in it. The only difference is, is the packaging is a little different. This is gold instead of silver. But I already had the, I already had it. So I was like, well, although the packaging is pretty, you know, I have the shape. <laughs> so that's the lip gloss on top of this rosewood lip liner. So, what do you think? This is it. Final look. You like it? <laughs> I hope you do. Thank you guys so much for being here. I really appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to subscribe below. Really appreciate everyone who subscribes, who watches. You guys are the best, and thanks so much for supporting me. I will leave my latest video right here, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, y'all.